Forsaken Tower? You certainly should not be turning up at my party uninvited and flouting the dress code. You're good for a little entertainment. I do hope you can stay the distance, peon. <laughs> and the just. I thought fun happened to other people. I have done things you could never dream of, little man. <laughs> the shackles of morality and antiquated dogma. <laughs> What is life without a little pain? They die to give me pleasure. Yeah! <laughs> 
You have a little skill, peasant. But do not overestimate it. I have more. That greedy dwarf king that he can't have his wedding presents back. If I'm not going to have a wedding, I at least want presents. <sighs> That's well. The wizard taught me how to seek my freedom. I won't let you take it, you uncouth lout. Never! <laughs> Always watching. There are no pleasures greater than those of the flesh. Well, hello, dark stranger. The rumors do not do you justice. You brought me a gift. Some little pixies. You really shouldn't have. Next time, make it something shiny and expensive. Now, let me thank you properly. She's obviously fine. She can find her own way out. Ooh, she's quite the tasty treat, sire. Oh! Ugh! Narl, go to your corner. I'm going down there to sort this out. Sire, the tower can only accommodate one mistress, unfortunately. Come to play the concerned big sister? Come to spoil my fun, have you? And just as my rescuer and I were about to become... You know, I'd increase the abilities of his red and green pixies. And I could do so much more for you, darling. Especially if you take this bed back with me. Don't listen to her. Never listen to her. That's people's first mistake. Turn this door wheel and let's go! Yes, obvious choice. Better pack your bag, sister. And I thought you had a brain somewhere beneath that armor.
can now upgrade your reds and greens in your private quarters, Lord. Darling, we're going to have such fun. You, me, a few helpless prisoners. It's going to be so romantic. Ah! But don't bring the pixies. Oh! You should really try and make this place a little more befitting of a lady. Find me a few pretty things, <laughs> and I'll make it worth your while. Salutations! Good is that to me? Now don't forget to buy a few things for your mistress. I've always wanted one of those. I hope you don't expect me to clean that. I hope you don't expect me to clean that. What's the fun in having gold if you don't spend it? I've always wanted one of those. An excellent choice, darling. Oh, you dark romantic fool. Oh, you dark romantic fool. For little me? For little me? Oh, you remembered me, sire. What's the fun in having gold if you don't spend it? Mistress Velvet requests the pleasure of your company in your private quarters, sire. Master! <laughs> <laughs> There you are, my darling. Now, the first thing we have to do is get you out of that heavy armor. Nice! Oh, sire. Well, that was a surprise. I think you're undercompensating, Ow. Master. Oh, well, no, 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 no. Ooh, my sister's been here. Oh well. Do you have any disinfectant? Purger ah. of the perverse paladin. Lord of lust and lechery!
an object. Oh. I like objects. has been upgraded. Too big to go over me knee, you know. Let me go and get the boys.
Stop that! Why'd you bother saving us? Mutations! of the perverted paladin. Giblet, wake up! There's forging to be done. This is your armory, sire, where you can store your armor and weapons. 
Lord of lust and lechery. Yeah. <laughs>